Phoenix Research Labs brings you the Micron Retinal Imaging Microscope, designed specifically for small research animals. We'll show you how to prepare and image a mouse. Select and scruff your mouse to instill dilating drops before anesthesia. You will place drops in both eyes. Wait 5 to 10 minutes and then with a small pen light check their pupil size. Be sure that the pupil is maximally dilated and does not constrict or get smaller as a response to the light. Induce anesthesia or sedation according to your research protocol. Once the animal is asleep, keep the corneas wet. This will avoid the formation of white cataracts and they will obstruct your view. Place the animal on the stage with its nose advanced forward. If necessary, add drops of saline, gel, or tears to keep both eyes of the animal moist. Excess liquid can be used to move fur from the eye. Coupling gel can be used to keep whiskers out of the way or the whiskers could be trimmed. Turn on the micron light and add a nice blob of coupling gel to the cornea. Now it's time to position your animal in front of the lens. You can slide the animal stage into place, adjust the vertical up and down, as well as swing it side to side and swivel the animal platform. Maneuver the animal so that the eye or pupil is centered in the image frame. As you bring the camera forward towards the eye, using the midline knob under the camera, you can adjust the brightness of the image so that you have an idea of what you're looking at. Adjust your focus on the iris of the eye. Wipe away any stray eyelashes covering the cornea. As you advance the camera closer, continue to focus and check that the cornea and the lens are both clear. You'll see the red reflex of the retina in the pupillary space. With the eye centered in view, slowly move the camera forward to couple with the gel and the cornea. Adjust focus and illumination to optimize details of the retinal features. Capture still images or video from your Micron system. Imaging fluorophores with the Micron is as simple as the turn of a couple of dials. A barrier filter wheel and an exciter filter wheel hold positions for four filters. By turning each filter wheel from the bright field at position 1 to position 2, you can easily switch to fluorescein imaging. In this example, the flow of fluorescein stained blood cells can be seen in the capillaries. In the left eye of this mouse, fluorescein is seen in the bright field image. It shows up in the blood vessels as well as in the scars created by the Micron 532 laser. By turning the exciter and barrier filters to position number two, full fluorescence is visible. Two extra filter slots allow users to insert filters to look at a whole host of other fluorophores. Take a look at how the Micron 4 is the host to an ecosystem of image-guided products designed to fuel scientific discoveries in small animal research. The image-guided focal ERG. The image-guided OCT. The image-guided 532 laser. 
the anterior segment slit lamp imaging system and the Gansfeld ERG. Phoenix Research Labs. For more information, check our website at phoenixreslabs.com.